Left-handers 3-1 pitch. Swinging a ball rope down the left field line. If that's fair, it's trouble. It is a fair ball. Rattles around the corner in to score is Ortiz. Now waved around third is Newell. Relay to the plate, not in time. This game is tied as Ethan Anderson catches in with a two RBI double on a laser shot down the left field line. Here's Casey Salke now. He swings and lines one towards right center field, and that's going to get down for a base hit. Late start for Anderson, who had to make sure it was going to get down. Throw comes back in, and there is no relay as Anderson scores, and Virginia leads for the first time today. This season, and for good reason, we're seeing a lot of it already here at the beginning of this game. Now the ball gets away from the catcher, Rooney, and home to score from third is Salke. So Virginia tacks on another one, and all of a sudden, the Wahoos doubling up the Rams 4-2 here in the second. It's a different home plate umpire that they had been expecting to send to Charlottesville. Ball lifted to center, and a diving effort by Newell, and he's there to make the play. Just barely had enough time to keep that one from touching the grass. Swings and rolls one out towards second base, and that will get the job done. So home from third is Salki, as O'Malley has only one play at first base. And we've got a tie ball game once again. Swings and hits it up the middle, and that's through for a base hit. Tappen's third hit of the ball game. Drives home to go ahead run for the Hoos here in the sixth. It's Virginia six, VCU five. And proving that it is truly part of his repertoire as he pulls this one towards the corner on a line. That ball's well tagged and gets out of here. Not just defense. Doing it with the bat as well. Coming off a two-homer weekend, and he's got another one here tonight. That line drive got out of here in a hurry and gives Virginia a very big insurance run here in the seventh. Yeah, if you blink, you missed that ball right there from Chris Newell. And as soon as it left his bat, Salki swings, gets a hold of one, shoots it out towards left center field. That ball's well tagged. O'Brien's going to watch this one clear the clubhouse. Casey Salki with a long home run to left center field. And Virginia's bats have come to life in the seventh. Second home run of the inning to open it up a little bit and make it a 9-5 to five Wahoo lead. Salki just seeing the ball so well today at the plate already with two doubles. There's only one out for Kyle Teal, and he swings and ropes one to right field. That's down for a base hit, and the beat goes on for Virginia. Home from third, Rubin is in to score. Over to third base goes O'Farrell. The eighth man to bat in the inning. He swings and bounces it up the middle and through for another base hit. Alex Tappen has a four-hit night. This one brings home Griff O'Farrell from third base. The Wahoos have hit double digits.